So this question says the triangle, triangle X, Y, Z, which we see here, that is shown below has psi lengths of X, Y, and Z, which we see already marked, and is not a right triangle, which is good because it doesn't look like it is a right triangle, but maybe, you know, maybe you would think this is, but it's, you know, it's not a right triangle, so let's not assume that it is. Let X, um, little ticker mark there, uh, X prime is the actual uh, correct terminology. Let X prime be the image of X when the triangle is reflected across YZ. So I can say this, right? If it were reflected across and that makes this X prime would be over here, right? If this were the reflecting line. Which of the following is an expression for the perimeter in inches of quadrilateral X prime Y X Z? So basically this outside shape here. I want to find the perimeter. So, well, what do I know? I know that I'm going to have a Y and a Z. And then isn't this also Y? And isn't this also Z, right? Like this line is just a reflection of this line. And this line is just a reflection of that line. So what I should have here is just 2Y plus 2Z for my perimeter, right? And this is the value of actually drawing this stuff down. So which one of these answer choices is true? Well, X is not involved, right? X is this diagonal, so it's not actually part of the perimeter. So any answer choice that has X is gone, which even understanding that, right? So even if you didn't understand anything else but the fact that X cannot be part of the perimeter, it forces you to choose choice K as the answer. And in fact, right, when I distribute this 2, I do get 2Y plus 2Z for choice K.